this is an unusual environment. None of their peers have ever been out in a place like this, and yet it's maybe three blocks from their home. But we have a group out here called Natural Leaders, and they're having a great time today. They've planted plants here. They're going to be owners. They, they achieve ownership through planting these plants, and uh, they'll be more protective. And that's what we want to do is to, to grow up our protection here, just like we grew up the wild rice. And the wild rice is going to attract sora rails and other bird life here, as well as take up nutrients from the water in the river. So the plants are cleaning the river, and the plants are giving the kids some meaningful character-building activities that will last a lifetime. They'll always remember this activity, because they'll be here to watch it go through its evolution. All right, this is how it goes. You get a little, you get a, a wild grass seed, and you plant it in a, a, a plant pot. And then you got to have water, mud, and uh, some seeds. And you put it in there, and then you let it sit, and it's going to grow. It's going to get this big. And then you take it to a larger marsh, and you put it in there so that the water can have oxygen. When I get home, I tell my people I help clean up the Anacostia Park by planting wild rice. I do believe that one person can make a difference because it only takes one voice for everybody to hear. Today we clean the Anacostia by planting these plants.